What is up, you guys? I'm Farah, and today we're reacting to episode 8 of The Angel Next Door Spoils Me Rotten. Last episode, we found um, the second worst parents to ever exist in anime history. I'm so excited about that. So fun. So great. Um, I love seeing parents come to life in anime bars um anyways if you guys would like to see my uncut reactions make sure to go check them down below in the description to help support me in the channel and without further ado let's get into it <gasps> what classes are they in what classes are they in that's a good sound that sounded good he's with her Hmm. Ah, she's there! <gasps> Dude, everybody knows it, so why aren't you admitting it? She's happy to be in the same class with you. And she was upset you didn't take the hint before, dipshit. I don't trust this man fully because like he's so like well liked by everybody but I guess it's also the concept of like you know a different angel that is adored by everybody but not close to any which is why he probably really appreciated Amane's like care by giving him like that bag to carry his you know multitude of fucking sweets um so I can kind of understand that as well though like I can okay I'll give him a chance fine I've convinced myself So he was bullied, and so somebody who he clearly like valued or was nice to his face was mean behind his back or mean to him in public. Sorry. So clearly he has trust issues. Baby was bullied, huh? It's okay. It's not. He's not. I don't think he'll do that though. He seems like a good guy. Probably troubled by his past, baby. That's why his parents keep checking up on him, huh? I mean, she opened up to you. Ma'am? Girl? <gasps> no way she's pulling this. Sit on my lap. No, bro. Come on. My, like, at this point, like, you you think they're you're together, don't you? Because, like, otherwise you're, like, fully entrapping this man into falling in love with... Come on, bro. Bro. Not appealing to you? Girl! Hey, what the fuck is going on? Girl, why did we when did we grow these gigantic balls? You're in kind of a compromising position. Oh, his his balls? <laughs> I'm sorry, that's so funny. Fondle his hair? Easier to touch you? Girl, what are you saying? Oh, how sweet. Is this her way of caring for him? Because she knows something's wrong, but he doesn't want to talk about it. Habibi, I wonder if he wants to cry. <laughs> not her saying i let you sit on my lap so i'm gonna have to you know force you to tell me your trauma now come on pick it up fam come on this is payment now <laughs> or else I could fall in love with you. 
It seems like she's almost telling him to fall in love with her. It feels purposeful now. Mahiru, do you like him already? I mean, I think you do, but... I don't want to put words in your mouth. Not her asking, hey, tell me how happy you are I'm in the same class with you. Baby. Oh. She's not happy with that. But she's upset that you want to do it. Oh, without like sadness? What do you mean? What does that mean? Are you dumb? Bro, boys and also men are fucking stupid. Does she have to say it out loud for you? What is with the fucking situation of not getting the fucking hint? Like, do men just choose to be dumb? Like, are y'all just choosing ignorance? What the fuck? Does she have to spell it out for you? She said she's upset that you're not showing any emotion after you said that. Meaning she's sad that, like, yes, it makes logical sense, but clearly she doesn't want you to be, like, so, like, happy fucking about it. Like, you're supposed to sound sad about it, at least shit. What do you mean? What the fuck? Aww, reassurance? She likes you, and you like her. Habibi, she's so sweet. Oh, she was just watching him? I would have turned the TV on at least. Aww. Now that she's been vulnerable, she wants him to be vulnerable. Yes, yes, school him. Bro. I feel like she's also sad that he's not opening up to her after she's become so vulnerable. It would hurt me too, personally. Like, I've let out the saddest story of my fucking life to you and you're not sharing the same one back to me? Shit. She's so baby. Yes. The fact that he only sees her like this is also super romantically coded. Shit! What are you gonna win her a prize? Dude, this guy's this guy's love language is gift giving, I'm telling you. I'm telling gift giving. He loves gifts. His is gift giving and hers is acts of service. That's how they give it. That's all I'm gonna say. What? Was that the bunny he gave her? He gave her- he got all of those for her? He got all of them for her? My god. Just propose already. Aww. Oh, now you get to pet her hair. 
Probably. <laughs> I'm gonna cry, they're so cute. Yeah, but you're also giving a lot. Girl. You don't think you are or you have been at all? A confession. Hey, hey, hey. Pure thoughts. Pudding, pudding. Oh. Oh, is she gonna get the more expensive one because she wants better ones for him? Damn, no, not him putting in special requests. Is she not aware of what she gives him? Aww. Not her asking for words of affirmation. That's what she wants to receive. They're so cute. It's so weird because every, I I did the love language test. Guess what I got? Y'all won't believe this shit. I got equal percentages on every single one. Like literally 20, 20, 20, 20, 20. What the fuck? Baby. I feel like you give her enough also. They they both say Bucca when they're falling in love, you notice that? Shy guys, guys, at this point, it should be point blank obvious. Like, what's going on? Like, are you both just stupid? Like, I'm actually, like, upset now. Like, <laughs> come on, guys. <laughs><笑><笑> Aww. Somebody who did it because he is a good guy, probably because he showed up for him and was kind to him without being jealous of him, as all the other guys in the class seemed to be when it came to him. Is this such a Horamiya vibe? A money appreciator. Why would there have to be? Romantic. What is she jealous? Oh my god, is she jealous or is she worried about him? What is that? Did that Yuta guy do something weird to her? Oh, <laughs> oh. 
She was just jealous. I mean, it feels like. She's just jealous. That he gets to be his friend in public? She wants to be his friend in public? Baby girl, you guys are the ones holding yourself back. You don't have to hold yourself back. Stop calling her that. Don't call yourself that. Exactly. Yeah, she values you so much. And just the same way that she shits on herself and doesn't ever think she's good enough, he does the same fucking exact shit. They're like copycats of each other. They're like yin and yang, okay? They're literally yin and yang. As fuck. As fuck. Okay? It's actually like borderline upsetting to me. Well, actually, that wouldn't be yin and yang because then they would have to be opposite. Whatever. We're not talking about that right now. Okay? But like, still. Like, I just want him to be more confident in himself. And she's right. It does almost sound like he's mocking the people who like him because how could you just say you're not worth liking? all the time it's almost like you're being like are you sure you guys are seeing right like you're doubting them and that's insulting in its own right like trust if you can't believe in yourself believe in them and believe in what they see in you hmm. yes baby oh <laughs> Sound completely natural. Mm. Yeah. Cutie. I love them. She's so pretty, wow. <laughs> Literally, he was shitting bricks. It's so cute he calls her Sheena in public. Oh No, literally. Oh! Romantic. Oh. Liar! Will you talk dirty to me? ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっと。ちょっ
そうですねもう少し見つめた方がいいですねわかったわかった They're so in love お二人さんさなんかこうなんというか新婚さんしたぜさんお味噌汁の用意はい The way she shot her up with the sternness in her voice. Oh, and she feels it too, though. Dude, it's so obvious she likes him. Be so real with me. That looks so good. Because he's sleeping over at her house, huh? Y'all are in love. Be so for real with me. <gasps> no, no, no! That would have fucking burned her alive. Not the hero moment. Not him being a hero right now. Dude, they're all gonna fall in love with him now. He's so cool right now. Dude, they're like oh, in public. Bro. Dude, let go of her in public. Responsible king. Ooh, that looks so good. Yeah, he was cool. Is he dumb? <laughs> it's not that he's dumb. Like, I know it's because, like, he probably doesn't feel like he deserves the love of somebody so perfect in his eyes. Because, once again, he just doesn't have confidence. Um, But look at how jealous she Like, how upset she is that he, it's like he had to. Not like I wanted to hold her. Dude, just be open about your feelings. I want to just be open, bro. Yeah, you are. He, he literally means that when he says he literally means that when he says like abandon like i know what it feels like but also not her being upset at the friend not her being upset at the friend dude you friend zoned him let him out let him out bro Oh, she's saying only for me. Only for me. She's jealous. Are you dumb? Every time they say baka to each other, they're literally essentially saying... They're literally just telling each other, I like you. For you to know that she likes you, you idiot. Girl, just say it. Just say it, honestly. <laughs> Love her! <laughs> Pat my head. <laughs> I'm 
Bro, come on. Amane, come on. Does anybody else want to punch the screen? I've never felt a sudden urge to punch a screen in my life. Like, I'm actually like angry. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm fucking mad. Like, <laughs> what the hell? What the actual hell is going on right now? Like, I'm actually upset. Like, 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 come on. She likes you. She likes you. And she's finally admitting it to herself. And, 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 and you know you like her. And I know it's probably not going to happen in the show until he's like learning to like accept that people can like him and that he's deserving of that because clearly he was betrayed in the past in a different type of friendship before. But like, I just hope that he learns that he is worthy of her. And she constantly tries to like give him more confidence because he deserves more confidence. He's a great guy, dude. He's a fucking amazing guy. And it's just like upsetting to me how much or how little he sees in himself. It, it just sucks, honestly. <sighs> So excited for another week next week of um on bird and pain of course <laughs> anyways thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of me i hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys next time bye